Hey YouTube, what's going on? It's Mr. Hino with Mr. Hino's Lego Robotics. Well, today I have like a problem slash solution, um, but I probably need some, maybe some advice, some ideas from those of you that teach robotics on identifying the brick. So here's what I do. I put uh, these stickers to identify whose brick is it that this belongs to, you know, for the school year. But, however, sometimes I pick the wrong kind of sticker, and this is what happens. Ew. Yeah, we get that crazy sticker residue. So, the first part of this video is, do, you, do any of you have any great ideas on how to identify the brick? Um, I mean, you know, like before, I would number these, but, you know, that's kind of a headache to have to keep checking. Hey, who's number 23? So, uh, I have, you know would love to get some great ideas on how to identify a brick. Um, I have tried like a label maker before, um, but that has its own issues too. But let me go ahead and show you what I'm going to do. Obviously, nobody wants to get a brick that has this residue like this. So I'm going to show you what to do uh, on how to make it relatively clean like this one. I guess this one can use some more cleaning. But let me go ahead and I'll be back to show you how to clean that up. Okay, so I need something to get this off. Um, obviously, paper towel and water is not going to do the trick. It just gets all messed up. So, went to Target, and it's called Goo Gone. And this stuff is amazing. No, I do not work for them. I don't get any kickback from doing this video. I'm just showing you what's amazingly awesome to use to get this off. So... I want you to see how bad this is. I mean, that's pretty bad. That's not coming off super easy. But, just a few sprays. And watch what happens. I was amazed how very little work I had to do for this. Here I am thinking I'm going to have to get something to scrape it off with. But look, there is all the sticker junk. And look at that. Shiny like we just took it out of the box. So that's just <clears throat> my take. Again, uh, it was called Goo Gone. And that just t takes it off. I mean, it's so easy. I might consider just dealing with this sticker junk every year if it's going to be that easy to take off. And, you know, <clears throat> bricks need to be cleaned anyway because, no offense, but these students with their sticky, messy Cheeto hands and whatever, it brick doesn't brick does get dirty and messed up. But look at that. So it went from something... <clears throat> this is actually not too bad, but it went from something as dirty as that to this in what, 10 seconds? So anyway guys, that's just my take on cleaning the brick from sticker residue, but I'm still looking for comments down on the bottom here on what I might be able to do to identify bricks and not get sticker residue when we try to pull it off. So I would appreciate any help on this issue. Everybody, I'm Mr. Hino for Mr. Hino's Lego Robotics. I am out. Have a good day, guys.